Thunder Bay Health Coalition began collecting votes from the public today for what it's calling a people's referendum against the Ford government's Bill 60. The bill allows private clinics to perform more health procedures, but the Ontario Health Coalition insists it's another step towards privatized health care in the province. Fourteen voting booths have been set up at locations around Thunder Bay, where those with an opinion about Bill 60 can cast a ballot, answering yes to no to the question, do you want our public hospital services to be privatized to for-profit hospitals and clinics? The voting process is taking place today and tomorrow, and about 120,000 ballots have already been cast online province-wide. Local Health Coalition co-chair Jules Tupker says his organization has polling stations across the Northwest. Port Francis, they can cast a ballot at the Safeway store and out the Canadian Tire, uh, at, the, at the Beaver Mills uh, uh, market in uh, Rainy River. In, uh, in Scriber, they can vote at the Town Hall and Zechner's store. Uh, in Terra's Bay, they can vote at the, uh, the Town Hall also, the Recreation Centre, which is all the same building. In Scriber also, where, the, where people vote on a regular for the provincial and, and municipal and federal elections, at the same location there. Uh, so there's, uh, in, in Red Rock, you can vote at the, uh, at the Legion. Close to 1,000 voting stations have been set up province-wide. The votes will be counted on Sunday, the results will be announced on Tuesday, and then delivered to Queen's Park a day later. The province is under no obligation to accept the results of the vote.